hello, and welcome to AudioQuest. I hope in the coming minutes that uh, you'll be entertained and come away with a little more perspective on, on AudioQuest and maybe on all of audio and why it's such an interesting arena. Before we start showing you around AudioQuest and letting you meet some of the amazing people that, that make AudioQuest possible, I want to take just a, a few seconds, or more than a few, uh, to try to set a bit of a context of the world in which we operate, the world of, of audio. Every single piece matters. Every cable, every connection, every amplifier, speaker. It doesn't matter what else is in the system. When you cause less damage with any one piece, the result would be better sounding music, audio, at the other end of the system. It's common to refer to all differences in audio as being amplitude or volume related. Uh, so if the high frequencies are obnoxious, it's natural to think that the high frequencies have been boosted in some ways. Or if you can't really hear the detail and not so good audio system, you can't tell the room and the sound of the fingers touching the guitar string or fine details are lost, it's tempting to think, oh, the treble has been turned down. That is almost never the case. It is possible for the amplitude to be different, one headphone to another, one speaker to another. But pretty much, the dominant mechanism that causes this either apparent loss of information or apparent boost of energy is really just time relationship differences. So we have microphones and then we have computers and the computer processes that information and does the best it can to make uh, an internal view of the world, whether it's what our eyes do or what our ears have perceived. Uh, so while it's normal and correct and, and reasonable to talk about, oh, that sounds bright and that sounds dull, uh, it's very important to keep the sounds like and never to think that just because it was dull, that meant it had no treble, or just because it was bright and irritating, it meant that the treble was boosted, because that will lead to some potentially compensating coloration and a system that really isn't very good because sticking one Band-Aid on top of another or a band-aid over a cut is not as good as just being healthy to begin with. First comes an understanding of the joy of audio and how to get there. And at the end of the process comes what are the pieces you need to actually make it happen. And cable is an important one and a few other toys that you'll learn about that we're working on.